Yeah, it is. Hi. How did we both manage to get drunk during an apocalypse? What the fuck else are you supposed to do? Remember, this is a plague apocalypse. Alcohol kills Ironically, drugs. we played Munchkin Apocalypse tonight. Because it seemed thematic. <laughs> That's exactly what and I said. And then we both proceeded to get fucking pissed. How did that happen? And on Tuesday, while we're still under lockdown, more or less. We're going to play Pandemic. <laughs> we're going to play Pandemic. With the children. With the children. Because what else do you do during an apocalypse? It is a weird time, right? We should probably say some things about it the weird time. It is a very time. weird time. We went to the grocery store on my suggestion Thursday night because Thursday was the day that Doug Ford decided to close all of the schools. And that was one of the first big real dominoes to fall, right? Uh, yeah. Like it in really terms was. of closures and it was an every quote unquote social distancing, which I'm sure will give us great reminiscences 10 years from now. Mm hmm. Agreed. And so then we decided maybe we should go to the grocery store and stock up a little because and like we had almost no food in the house. It looked like something out of the stand. It did, right? Like the fact that they were locked up, that they were lined up at the Costco from literally the front of the, of the store all the way to literally the back wall of the store. Yeah. On two different sides. Yeah. That was insanity. It was insanity. And then. There was also the panicked looks on the faces of people as they were going into the Costco, which closed at 8.30, at 8.15, looking right, for who stuff. who the fuck goes to Costco at 8.15 when it closes at 8.30? And especially on the day where they announced that they're closing the schools for three weeks. Yeah. To keep the children yeah. safe, and even though the kids aren't the ones getting this freaking So virus. many people... No, no, the kids are getting the virus. They're not having symptoms, but they're spreading it. Are they? Is yes, that true? That's true. I didn't know that. Yeah. I actually thought that it was just like... When kids get this, they're asymptomatic, mm -hmm. but they are contagious. Well, so they're little plague rats. Children are little plague rats. Yeah, well, they always work. Really? <laughs> I remember from the first few years hanging around yours, they are definitely, yeah, definitely little, little plague, plague rats. rats. <laughs> yes, they are. But yes, so we live in the end times. Uh, and end times. Well, I mean, this, well, this is only I, it's the like first. The, it's like Buffy. I, what's, what's the, the plural, plural for apocalypse? apocalypse? <laughs> and the fact that I know that what the plural of apocalypse is is kind of disturbing. But no, apocalypse is, is. Apocalypse I? No. And apocalypso is the music that you play when the world is ending. Really? <laughs> Two steps forward, three steps back? Yep. And you can alternate that with Ragnar Rock and Roll. Really? <laughs> What is the plural of apocalypse? Is Apocalypses. it apocalypses? That doesn't sound... It's awkward. It doesn't have enough gravitas is what I'm saying. No. And the fact that we're using words like apocalypses and gravitas when pissed drunk <laughs> after playing, let's be clear, Munchkin, Munchkin apocalypse, apocalypse. That's pretty freaking funny. Anyways, yes, Thursday night at the Costco. Thursday night at the Costco was pretty crazy. Uh, and then coming out of the Costco and going across the street to the Shoppers Drug Mart, which was much calmer. It was. But no toilet paper. Yeah, no toilet. That is the first thing that disappeared. Seriously, the toilet paper apocalypse has been really odd. It is really like, weird. The thing is, this virus does not make you poop. No. So I do not understand why everybody is hoarding the freaking... Because they were hoarding it in Australia. And everybody read the stories. Is so that it? I think is that's that really it. it. I think that's it. I just assumed it was like, you know... It's the same thing with the canned goods and the tuna in the, in the last couple of days. Yeah, it's like everybody's just buying apparently the shit that you need to get through the stand, not to get through this. Yep. Because, like, toilet paper is for when civilization collapses. And canned mm -hmm. food, similarly, when civilization collapses, slash, we lose power, power for five, six, water. seven yes. days. But, like, it's, and no water. There is no water and there's no soap. Oh, really? I didn't see that. Well, I knew the soap because, of course, disease and wash your hands. Germs and, and everybody's yes, saying, your wash your fucking course, hands. Yes, like that is the entire medical community's advice for how to not get the thing that's going to kill 100 million people on the planet is, by the way, wash, wash your, your hands. hands. Yeah. Longer. That'll help. Basically, us. wash your hands for as long as it takes you to sing happy birthday twice. Really? That is the instructions. Oh, they're full of shit. Take more vitamin D. See, this is the problem. But they'll do that, but then they'll say, oh, by the way, take 400 IUs a day 
of vitamin, vitamin D. D. That's the problem, right? Yeah, well, you need to wash your hands for four hours. If you're only taking 400 IUs of vitamin D, then you live in Canada. No, you need to take more fucking IUs of vitamin D. Yeah. 20,000 a minimum for healthy people. If you are immune suppressed in any way or have any sort of chronic disease, you should probably be taking 30 to 40. Yep. God damn. All the sports uh, leagues have suspended operations. Hockey is no longer. Oh, poor baby. Basketball is no longer. Baseball is... For the season, not like mm -hmm. forever. Baseball is delaying their opening opening day and canceling their um, spring training. Formula One racing is, is uh, not running their mm -hmm. season because you can't have that many people gathered. Mm -hmm. So if you're... What are they going to do? Race for 100 people? No. TIFF is closed down. TIFF I have is to assume closed down. The South major... by Southwest was closed. Toronto Comic Con was canceled. Coachella. Coachella has been canceled. And they're talking about me. Well, I mean, there's rumors about the Olympics. There's not really like. There has been pressure to close the Olympics, and the Japanese, the, the, the head of the Japanese Olympic delegation has said, fuck no, we're going to do this. Yeah, probably because, I don't know, they probably spent $500 million or more building everything so like i mean i get it i don't think they're gonna have anybody there well when you went to the grocery store there were not many people in the parking lot how many people were in the store this uh, is three days in there was not to many when it people got crazy. in the stores at all by the way you know this is a canadian song of course isn't this like um mc maestro fresh west oh i thought it was um what was that white guy who rapped a lot in the 80s uh, vanilla ice. Vanilla ice. I thought it was vanilla I don't think ice. so. Anyways, and you are home. I am home. For uh, at my least two office weeks. has uh, declared that the office is off limits unless you get uh, permission from your leadership team uh, member. So in my case, that means I have to get permission from the CTO to go into the office. Yeah. I mean, RBC has been a little more, um, let's say, conservative. And they've said that each team will decide on their own, but they're encouraging you to do less face-to-face -face and more of the social distancing that has been so yeah. very, very popular as a concept for the last week or so. Twitter is a flutter. Trump is an idiot. Yes, Trump declared a national emergency ban travel from Europe for non-Americans. Which is, as we said, about 550 years too late. Yep. And... Um, is uh, only four days from uh, claiming that the Democrats were in cahoots with uh, mainstream media to make this seem more dangerous than it actually was. Yeah. He declared a national emergency, which gives him access to $50 billion to uh, fuck around and do something about this. Yeah. But to be clear, in Canada right now, we have how many people? Like 140 people or something with... There's 200. maybe 200 people with, 200 people with the people as, as of 5 o'clock In the today. whole country. And of that, how many have died? Two. We've had two deaths in the whole country. And the whole freaking country is shut down. That's a little weird. It is. Tom I, Hanks has it. Yeah, as does our Prime Minister's wife. Our Prime Minister's wife has it. Um... So Trump, like all the important Trump people, declared basically. Yeah, Trump declared himself to be free of it today. Yeah, I read like six different tweets saying like, you know that motherfucker was tested like 12 times and just did not actually tell people that he was tested 12 times. Because yeah. he shook hands with like, I don't know, half, half of, of the people the who people... were infected. This is the thing that I find so interesting about it is it seems to be like spreading from like the, the very wealthy and very powerful down because of course it's being transmitted by handshakes and kisses on the cheek and all of that horse mm -hmm. shit. Apparently Switzerland has completely abandoned the uh, three kisses on the cheeks greeting. Switzerland was three? Like I thought France Switzerland, was intense. Switzerland was three and that's been in place for centuries and they're just not doing it now. I saw a lovely gif on the um, Slack at work about um, uh, showing a uh, from Demolition Man where the two people like do like the put your hand up like the this <laughs> and I was like I had to love the use of that gif that was like a really really good use of a gif and so like I put like a seashell and nobody got it and I'm like dude how do you not get the three seashells you love me I do very very much 
Italy is under complete quarantine. Everyone is in Italy is completely shut down. I says Spain now. now right? Spain today and yeah. France has declared that all non-essential stores are to close. Yep, yeah, and they've also shut down the Louvre and Versailles and the Eiffel and Tower. The Eiffel Tower which is so crazy. But also, can we just point out opportunity for us to finally go and get Versailles when nobody's there? We could. Can we just storm it? Like there can't be that many people defending it when there's not thousands of tourists. I feel like we could just take it Can you imagine us. going to Versailles right now? You'd oh, see it with no fuck fucking me. tourists. <gasps> and all the gold and all the guilt. And I could go up and look at it close up and touch it and lay in the pretty bed and pretend that I was a princess because um, why haven't you bought it for me yet? They won't sell it. I keep raising you the price. You haven't tried. Stop. Okay, offering them $5 is not going to be good enough. <laughs> Oh my God. I've gone okay. up as high as 12. You have not. All right, that's it. We will have more, I am sure, from Apocalypse Central as things develop. But for this, this is day, what? We're going to call this day four, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, three, really? Today, this is day three this of is day three Apocalypse Central. Of Apocalypse Central. I like this. I love you. I love you too. Bye. Bye.